So uh, how much do you think y'all have kind of embraced that uh, underdog role during these, these past few weeks leading up to the playoffs? I don't think we. I don't. I don't think that's been the mentality here. Um, you know, we know what we're capable of. Um, you know, uh, we we lost Boog and had to had to pick up the pieces. Uh, but I think somebody had said it. I was watching a broadcast or watching coach, and we was like a three or four seed when we had Boog. And um, you know, we know what we can do out there on the court, and we respect every every team. But uh, we're not looking at it as an underdog situation. Uh, we, we believe that in order to, to, to be the best, you have to look at yourself as the best. So we feel like when we step on the court, we're just as good as anybody. Do you think it's important to have that type of confidence going into a series like this? Well, no, it's, it's important to have it in any series. You know, no matter who you face up against, uh, we respect every opponent. You know, um, we're, we respect Portland just as much as we respect Golden State. We know what they've done in the past, but this is a new year. Uh, we're trying to all accomplish the same thing. So. We're going, to go out, we're going to have the same mentality. We're not going to prepare more for Golden State than we did for Portland. We respect all our opponents, and that, that consistency alone uh, will help us try to be the best team we can be. Coach Gentry's talked about how it's going to take a team effort to stop all one, all those guys, especially Kevin Durant. But do you see any of it as a personal challenge for you when you go out on the court? You'll probably likely be matched up on him a lot. Um, I just try to do my best to, to work with Irm and, and know his tendencies, know what he wants to do, know the plays that um, it's going to be called for him. Um, but with their team, it's going to be multiple guys. You know, I might start off on KD within a play, and I might be on end up on Steph Curry or Clay Thompson, Draymond. So um, it's not just going to be about one guy. It's like you said, as a team. You know, everybody has to be prepared to guard everybody. Um, and we have to have that mindset that, you know, you might start a play on one guy, you might finish on another. So how do you feel like you guys match up overall with Golden State? Pretty equally? Um, I mean, we, we, we feel good about our chances as far as, you know, our matchups. But... Um, they, they do the same thing as far as, you know, they might want a, a certain type of matchup, but at the end of our play, you know, Draymond might be on. He might go from Drew to AD. So I think it's about the communication. I think whatever team can communicate, rebound, and take care of the ball will have the best chance to win. Do you think uh, that move having Nico and AD as a starting front line has allowed you all to kind of dictate matchups a little bit more? Oh, uh, for sure. You know, just our pace. You know, I think our pace alone um, allows us to dictate, dictate matchups and, uh, we just have to continue to be who we are, uh, make teams adjust to who, who, how we play, um, and then we go from there. Um, do you feel like you've actually, um, ever since the regular season ends, do you feel like your health, your strength has even come back that much more? Oh, uh, yeah. The last couple oh, of weeks? Oh, for sure. Yeah, I think every every week it's growing. You know, every every week uh, I'm definitely getting stronger and still um, in that rehab phase where I want to, you know, get back to uh, 100%. Um, but I feel good just going out there and playing and competing and, and uh, doing as much as I can. Now, how much do you think having uh, Ian around has helped, you know, with how familiar he is with that team and just his knowledge of all of those guys? I mean, you got to think, uh, our coach, uh, two of our coaches were there, and, and not only Ian, but, uh, you know, when you have two coaches that were part of that situation and part of, uh, you know, winning there, I think that has a lot to do with, you know, our game plan and our scheme and Ian being comfortable with how they want to play and being a championship, championship guy. Um, it, it just makes us that much more comfortable with what's being said. You know, we can ask Ian, is that how it's going to be run? And he'll, he'll let us know and coach will do the same. So, we, we you know, it's one thing to kind of hear about it. Uh, it's another thing that they know that we have some guys that were a part of them and they might come out with a whole different game plan. Thank you. Thank you.